you know, this game isn't that long, or it shouldn't be that long, uh, I assume. I think we're doing really well for our pace, and I think I can beat this all in one sitting. Even though it's getting late, who might start falling asleep on you guys here? Considering... I'm not gonna lie, it just rolled over to 3 a.m. But hey, you know who's recording schedule with for Let's Play Anything. This is Let's Play Pranken, by the way. And uh, vibing to the overworld music in this game is pretty good, too. Other dragon? What? No, that's the same dragon. I'm tired of dragon and garden treasure and breathing flames and all that. I think I'll get into making soup. Oh. Guess I can't refight the dragon, but the dragon sure does, you know, seem pretty normal now that I've killed one. Everything has changed. I think this is very nice. It's a shrimp. This is so cool. It's the lobster I killed. Crab. Yay, this is so fun. Okay. They're all having a beach day. Beach party. Oh, hey, there's a dude here. Tomato man. Oh, no, no, no. This is Poob. Can you please go away? There is not a lot of room here. Okay, Poob. Look, we can talk to uh, this guy again. Up, oh, fish man. Gary. Oh, the town was demolished? Bummer. Yeah, you should go to the Panther. They went to Leopard Zone. Welcome to Leopard Zone. There's the forest we started. Hey, what the hell? Maybe some slime I'll... Maybe some slime I'll get to be the protagonist. Oh, God. I know it'd be very unusable, but I'm a very good jelly. Oh, hey, they're, all these monsters came back, but they're, like, good now. Don't listen to them. They they just ate some strawberry... Oh, 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 he's, he's going to see his front. Oh, I see. The reason I turned red is that I've devoured countless humans. Slurp. Don't listen to them. They ate. A, they just ate some strawberries earlier. Is that how you get red jelly? Well, I mean, yeah, okay, strawberry jelly. Ooh, what's up, my dudes? Goblin. Sand located. Current intelligence report. One, sand is the smallest thing in the earth and other than maybe salt or ants. Sand is quite fun. With sand, you can have some fun. Nice, playful fun. Sand is the type of beige glitter. Missing info. What is the boiling point of sand? The inventor of sand. What is the natural predator of sand? We're trying to figure out how the sand works. This single tile of sand. <laughs> Oh no, the poop fan. I mean, the the, the 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 condor fan. I couldn't even remember their name. Poop. What was that other guy? Welcome to Leopard Zone. Okay, so I can't swim. I thought I would come back here and swim, but that's not happening. But there is stuff going on over here, so let's go. This is the kids' island. It's a cool place for kids to get to be kids. Where are you again? Pouchy. Graham, this is where the water park will go. Beffrey. Oh my god, Beffrey. That's the name. Hold on. <laughs> I'm worried about the direction Kids Island is heading in. I've seen the mar the makings of an, auto uh, an, autocrac an autocracy and have been branded a dissident. If all we eat is candy and our bedtimes are never, we won't have the nutrients and vitamins we need to become adults. Pouchies will be able to reign as leader of the kids' island forever. I'm only five, but I are—I have—I already have a lot on my plate. He makes a good point. Autocracy. Sorry, jeez, I couldn't say. Tried. Oh no. No 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 no. Fuck what I just seen there. Um, come back to it. Oh, airship, please. Meagle says, I'm exploring the world in search of love. I want to have a wife or to be a wife. He wants the waifu. You know what? I've seen a whiz orb. I think we should go go to the whiz orb. I know I'm too busy fooling around on the overworld, touching stuff and stuff. Where's that whiz orb at? Up, right? There it is. Hello, Wizard. We are here to fight you. 
Great wizard trove, but never mind, he's trove. Good afternoon, Ataki. You've done well so far to fend off the terrible forces of the Hell Knight. For this, I and many others are very thankful. You have proven yourself a true hero. However, there is more to this tale that me than meets the eye. Will you listen to this old woman's story? Sure, Trobe. We'll listen to the old woman's story. My story begins a long time ago. This is the story of the first eclipse ever. Oh god, wall of text. Let's go. The three celestial bodies, the earth, the moon, and the sun, existed in harmony for a long time. The earth, the incubator of life. The mighty sun, the provider of warmth and light. And the moon, who offers guidance and comfort in the dark of the night. The moon, however, felt lowly in its position, as it did not create life like the others. One day, the moon challenged the sun and positioned itself between the sun and the earth, blocking all light. What is the meaning of this? cried the sun. Do you not know that the... Re uh, know of the rever reverence people on earth hold for you the love that moths bats and owls carry for their heart uh, with their hearts i wish to be adored with a god with a god so adorned with a god so oh my god there's so much text i can't keep up with it bloom with life uh very well respond to the sun you'll get a god oh so it gave it a uh, clips on the great god of the moon but no matter Eclipse on strength, the moon remained a gray barren land for which no life could emerge. Eclipse on remained on the moon to this day, punching holes into the lunar surface in search of life-giving water. Long story short, Eclipse on is a man on the moon who was the, a, a god created to terraform it and failed. Thank you for listening to my story. I am old, and I am vanishing from this world. I trust you to take care of this blue orb. Holy shit. I, I, I did not mean for this to happen. Anybody who's been following the channel since Dragon Chronicles and or knows Dragon Chronicles absolutely knows this is not... This was not... I swear to fuck. I, I didn't plan this. I'm collecting fucking orbs uh, as Ataki again. I obtained a blue orb. I cannot believe this. I just thought about it. I'm getting orbs while people die as Itsaki again. Like, constantly. Oh look, a red orb. And I guess we'll go for the red orb first. Cerberus. Oh, you're here already? I haven't really had enough time to prepare get my battle ready. Well, actually, I have pl had plenty of time. I'm just easily distracted. Well, I'll show you what I've done so far, if that's okay. Oh no, placeholder. <laughs> Look at this shit. Cerberus draws near. Cerberus breathes an all-consuming fireball. Nope, dragon shield reflects, baby. Boom, 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 boom. Attack. Dead. Cerberus has been vanquished. Her level has been increased to 12. Yeah, still need some work, I know. That was just a placeholder graphic. Yeah, I could tell. It was the spider. And everything else. If I finish my battle late if, if I finish my battle later, will you come show will I'll come show you. Alright, see ya. Found Red Orb. Well, this was way easier to get Red Orb compared to uh, Dragon Chronicles Red Orb. Which is the most annoying orb to get because you have to beat the Snaggle Torque. And that thing is absolutely oh there's tiny man. That thing is absolutely bullshit. Oh my god, I can fight Tiny Man. Adam Flyder draws near. We gotta listen to his music. He's Adam Man. The Adam Fighter. This is the most Golgo 13 ass music I've ever heard. I didn't expect the guitars. Honestly, you should look up the OST of this game and just listen to it. I mean, I guess it's time to kill Adam, man. Holy shit, we do a lot of damage. Adam Fighter does a lot of damage. Wow, he hits hard. Adam Fighter has been vanquished. You didn't level up because the enemy was too small to contain any experience points. Oh, well, that was a fun side gimmick. Cool. Glad we killed him then. <laughs> oh shit, Skeleton Beach, let's go. Knickknack. We got stranded on this beach for so long that we ate ourselves and now we're skeletons. Paddywhack. I wish we could have had a meal. We. I wish we could have that meal we had long ago. Where's give a dog a bone? We don't have a third skeleton. Folks, give a dog a bone. Kind of sad. 
Okay, so it's beginning forest. I'm gonna hit up a lot of the a lot of the stuff and content to see. So much to see, so much to do, so much to see, so much to do. Okay, well, whoa, 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 whoa. Before we take on that guy. I'm at the end of the video anyways. But I'm gonna check out one thing and the next video will start there. I want to go back to the cave and see if Condor is somewhere in here. Hey, look. Ah, I feel so scary. Welcome to the murder zone, tick feet. <laughs> Son of a bitch. I can't go back deeper in the cave. I'm still not a monster or a stalactite or anything at all of that. I'm just a great cone. To the murder zone. Hey, chuckle fuck. Eat knife and throws knife. So, this has been Impact with Let's Play. Franken, the RPG. Don't forget to subscribe, rate, and comment. Next time, we will go take on the third orb of boss that we know of. And this one is pretty iconic if you know anything of the... If you know the developer of this game. That is all I will say. Can't lay on, land on gray tiles. Next time.